Hello guys, in this video I am going to explain about class diagram with the application of hospital management system. First what is class? Class is depicted using a rectangle divided into three sections. Top section is the name of the class. Middle section defines the properties of the class. The bottom section lists the methods of the class. Methods are nothing but functions done by the actors. Association. There are many relationships between two classes. First is association. Association is a single solid line. It's a generic relationship between two classes. Like we can uh, separate it as one to one relationship, one to many relationship, many to many relationship. These relationships are called multiplicity. Second one is composition. If a class cannot exit by itself, and instead must be a member of another class, then that class has a composition relationship with the containing class. A composition relationship is indicated by a line with a filled diamond. This is the symbol of composition. Dependency. A dependency relationship is indicated by a dotted arrow. This is dependency symbol. And aggregation. Aggregation indicate a whole part relationship and are known as has a relationship. Generalization. Generalization relationship is the equivalent of an inheritance relationship in object oriented terms. Is a relationship. Aggregation is a has a relationship. Generalization is a is a relationship. And these two has a different symbols. Now we will see the diagram. This is the diagram. If you know who are all the actors will be participating and what are the functions they will do by individual, then you can define a class diagram very easily. First, give, a, give the main class as a system, hospital management system. Inside that, who are all the, what are the attributes will be there? inside the system receptionist patient doctor and what are the functions they can be done by the system maintaining staff details salary maintenance medicine stock maintenance will be done by the management and inside that management we can define a subclasses receptionist patient and doctor each one will have individual name id phone number and email and Write it as an attribute of them. Receptionist attribute is name, ID, phone number, email, and patient and doctor's attribute is different. And what are all the functions done by the receptionist can be written in the third section, that is function section methods. Maintain patient details, assigning doctors for the patient, allotting rooms, generate bill, and inside the patient checkup, taking medicine pay bill and doctor what are what are the functions can be done by the doctors check report prescribe test prescribe medicine draw salary and we can define a another subclasses for a subclass patient there are two there will be two patients inpatient and outpatient we can define it as a, a subclasses inpatient they will have attribute as name, ID, room number and outpatient means they won't have room number so name, ID and phone number. And in, what are the uh, methods done by the inpatient? Get admitted, taking medicine. Outpatient, they will check up and get the medicine and check out. So this is the uh, whole class diagram you can see, the, see now.